I was talking to Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn, and I've decided that they're both going to get another shot at your U.S. title. I said they're both going to get a shot at your U.S. title in a two-on-one handicap match. If you thought the odds were against you in a fatal four-way, just wait until tonight. If I wanted your U.S. title, I wouldn't need to ask anyone for permission. I'd just take it. Stay out of my way unless you want an RKO. After we beat you tonight, we're going to be co-U.S. champions. He makes a good point. It is only fair. He is just trying to drive us apart before the match. And besides, we had a deal all worked out in writing. I faxed it to you, remember? I don't have a fax machine. It's 2018. I'm pretty sure you do. It made the fax noise. Sammy, Sammy, stop. Sammy, I get it. Stop. I get it. You know, so do we have a deal then? Co-champions? Yes, as long as you never make that noise again. Up next is the long-awaited championship match. We have one of our breakout talents against Team Kevin Owens. with excitement. Buzz is here. The following contest is a handicap match and is for the United States Championship. Introducing the champion. From your darkest There's fears, weighing in at 242 pounds, he is the it's United modern. States I champion, Buzzsaw Van Poole. That he uses as motivation before his matches. Sack, have you been snooping through people's phones again? No, Buzz told me about it, I swear. And introducing the challenger at a combined weight of 478 pounds, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn.
I can tell you guys that this arena sold out in record time, and a lot of that has to do with this match in the ring right now. This is easily one of the most anticipated title matches in recent memory. take place here i had dozens of people i know in and around the area calling and texting just hoping i could get them tickets that's how big this match is isn't that cute your friends actually think you have enough pull around here to get them tickets poor people champions head into matches maybe a little too confident only to be picked off in the end and guys i can't help but wonder if we're gonna see that again here tonight yanked him right off the apron oh no kevin owens may be in a bad way here i don't know about you but i don't like his chances of survival here in this handicap match Speaking of champions heading into matches a bit overconfident, one of the most glaring examples of that would have to be the Honky Tonk Man's attitude heading into his Intercontinental Championship defense at SummerSlam 1988. We all know what happened to him on that night. <laughs> you are so right, Michael. That was great. Of course, though, it wasn't so great for the Honky Tonk Man who ended up losing his championship to the Ultimate Warrior in fewer than 30 seconds. Max Handel finds the mark. Looking for the finish. A lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better, but that doesn't mean we can't see an upset here tonight. There goes KO with the mind games. His shoulders are down. An easy kick out there. We'll take more than that. As Byron was talking earlier about the champ being a heavy favorite here tonight, I couldn't help but think back to the night Santino Morella defeated Amaga for the Intercontinental Championship in 2007. I don't think there was a person alive who thought Santino had even a sliver of hope. Yeah, including Santino himself. But hey, as the old saying goes, anything can happen in the WWE. Zayn starting to struggle. To be expected, though, it's not like he's in there with a the slouch, guys. Guys, a lot of people are predicting a new champion here tonight. Even a poll on WWE.com earlier today predicted we'd have a new champ. But at the risk of being a downer, I'll believe it when I see it. Wow, I thought he was a goner. He's a ball of energy right now, but we'll see if it lasts. He's got him covered. And the champ kicks out. He showed up here tonight for a fight. And that's exactly what we are seeing. Oh, boy, he is blown. Powerbomb planted. But he's got to capitalize now. Two count and a kick out. And the match continues. trouble I don't think he should get up this is going to be big one way or another great job escaping trying to turn this thing around the challenge 
Challenger not in a great place. This is not at all where he wants to be at at this point in this handicap match. He's taking on some damage, but so is his opponent. This match can go either way at this point. He's in trouble. What is oh, tearing the features clean off your face? Wow, the crowd's on the edge of their seats. Here it comes. He's got him. Larry, victory is on the hook. Oh, that hurt on the chest. Will Buck? Oh, he kicked in the face. I'm not sure how much he has left. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Uh-oh, up across the shoulders. Oh, my goodness. Oh, has Buzz pulled off the impossible? No, he hasn't. I told you, these two would be on the same page. What the? RKO out of nowhere! Where did Orton even come from? Taking advantage! Shoulders are down! We got a new champ! Oh my gosh! It took a couple of tries, but with the help of an old friend, Triple H finally got what he wanted. You guys are burying the lead here. Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn are your new United States champion. Buzz never had a chance. With Orton interfering, it was essentially three on one. Four on one if you include Triple H.